Welcome back to the channel. Today is uh, Memorial Day weekend. It's Saturday. And what I have here is a 17 pound prime brisket and it's just beautiful. What I'm gonna do today is do my first cook on my Lone Star Grills pellet smoker. And I'm what, I'm, what I'm gonna do is write out a plan for the pellet smoker. This thing's gonna cook all night long and be ready for us tomorrow. So I'm gonna take it out of the packaging and do some trimming up on it, and I'll bring you back when I'm putting the rub on. Okay, I've got the brisket nice and trimmed up. I'm gonna use a binder. I'm gonna use mustard on it today. I'm gonna get it all over there because I want a nice bark from that pellet smoker. Nice and thick. Let's turn this bad boy over. Got a quarter inch of fat on the fat cap. That's exactly what I want. That nice pillowy white fat has lots of flavor. All right, I'm gonna start rubbing on the bottom side first. I wash my hands off. What I'm gonna use today is a salt and pepper base. And then, okay, I'm gonna start with the salt and pepper base. Get this on there. And find out how to open it. There we go. Put this on pretty good and thick. That pepper will hold smoke. Try to get it on the edges. Just pat it in. Then I'm gonna add the rub I got from uh, Brisket University. <laughs> I went to the three hour class last weekend and it's called the graduate rub. So I'm gonna put a layer of that on as well. So here we go with that. All right, let's flip it over and I'll do the same thing to the presentation side and I'll bring you back when I'm putting it on the fire. Okay, I wanted to let you know what my all night cook is going to be with the pellet smoker. It's going to start off at 180 degrees and when the meat temperature hits 160, it's going to bump it up to 215. When the meat temperature hits 180, it's going to bump it up to 220 until the temperature is 203. Once it hits 203, it'll drop down to 160 and keep it warm for us for tomorrow. So I'll bring you outside when I'm putting it on the fire. Okay, I got my plug ready on my pellet smoker. It's looking like the smoke is producing. So I'm going to go ahead and open this up. And put the brisket on. Put the fat cap up. Pointed towards the fire pit. 
also I have to put my meat probe in we put this tray over here Pellet smoker came with two of these meat probes. Of course, it's all wound up. Pellet smoker comes with a. If you come over here, I'll show you. Comes with a little slide where you can slide your probe in and plug it into the controller. So I'm going to go ahead and plug it in and slide it up in there. Now I'm going to put the probe in the meat. Oh, smoky. I'm going to put it right into the point. All right, and I'm going to shut it and let it run all night. We'll see what we got in the morning. Okay, I got up at 4.30 this morning and went and checked on the brisket. My camera lady was sleeping. She didn't get video of that, but it had a really nice firm bark on it, and I thought that's good enough. So I wrapped it in foil about 4.30, let it go to the temperature. It was 204 internal. Now I'm going to unwrap it a little and let it cool off a little bit. Ooh, look at that juice. Oh, look at that bark. Isn't that pretty? That's beautiful. It's just oozing moisture right now. So I'm going to make a little boat so it can sit in its own juice on this pan and let it cool a little bit so I can cut it. So I'll bring you back when I cut this thing. Okay, I've got my prime brisket ready to cut on the cutting board. What I'm gonna do first is cut the point away from the flat. Oh man, that's, that's tender. Look at that point. Man, mm, mm, mm. I'm gonna cut, start cutting the flat, making cuts here. About the size of a pencil. And it's nice and pink smoke ring right there. That's nice. There's the fold test. Let's see. Oh, it, it just pulls apart. Let me taste it with this bark. Mmm. That is really good bark. I'm gonna cut this point in half. Take a slice off the point. Let's see how that looks. There you go. Have a look at that. The fat's rendered. It just pulls apart. Still a little hot. 
So my first cook on my 20 by 36 Lone Star Grills pellet smoker came out great. Cooked overnight, it was ready when I got out in the morning. So give me a thumbs up on this video if you would. And subscribe to my channel, please. And I'll see you the next time I'm back there cooking something.